uh, <laughs> you're welcome. once, Quill. Entire worlds depend on it. I thought you and Pym had it all figured out, Tony. We've just got to get your gizmo up and running, and we're good. Planet? I mean, planets safe, right? Sure, but that only works if both Earths don't get blown to pieces by Ames' antimatter bomb first. So... As usual, it's up to me to guard the galaxy. Some things never change. Black Widow here. Aim is on the move. Quill, stay on target. I know what I'm doing here, lady. Trust me. Stuff never gets any easier. There you are, you busy bees. Sorry, guys, no time to talk. Oh! World's at stake in all that. Dude, it's over. Our mission, which you almost blew. So pull yourself together and head to the meeting point. Point A clear. Moving to point B. Be clear. Antimatter bomb located. Moving on to the next. Not so fast. 
You're fighting against the facts. Science will save us all. The only solution your big brains could come up with was a bomb? Sometimes sacrifices need to be made for the greater good. Hope you're willing to add your name to that list. <clears throat> Sacrifice accepted! In the name of the Goddess! Appreciated, Storm. Let's secure the bomb and head back to the meeting. You heroes seem to have missed the point. AIM has designed our salvation! If one world must die so that we can live, so be it! One to the heroes, Modoc. You say that every time, but you're always wrong. And 
antimatter bomb ready for launch. <laughs> Less chatter and more action. Launch the bomb already. Are you certain my world is the one that needs to die? One more complaint and we'll send you back to die with it. Okay, steady, Smite. You got this. You got this. Ready? Whip! Yes! Got it! Sorry to ruin the latest meeting of the enormous head club, fellas, but we've got two Earths to save! Gotta swing! Stop this instant, spider freak! Convergence is mere moments away! We devised the only viable solution! Killing an entire world to save yourself? Not an option! Sorry! Not one of you was annoying. <laughs> you will pay for underestimating the Modox! defeated you on countless Earths, Captain! <laughs> what?! All that knowledge in those brains, yet you use it to destroy life, not preserve it. Such a shame. Instead of science, is a bit of magic. No one dies today. Not on any world. Kill them!
It's over, heroes! <laughs> Someday you will thank AIM for this! No, we do not need to resort to such violent acts. Vision. All systems are go. If our calculations are correct, we can reverse the convergence. Hank Pym reporting. Convergence engines are online. Activating now. fluctuation in the wave frequency of the Convergium particles. We can't fail. Sir, the, the particles, they aren't synchronizing like we thought. Engine all agents. The convergence engines have failed. Initiate evacuation protocol. You tried your best. But there may be one more thing that can be done. If the convergence process cannot be stopped, perhaps I can use my density altering abilities in tandem with these engines. to bring our worlds together in a more harmonious manner. The Earth will be born anew. Take care of it, my friends. It was an honor saving the world with you all. Research on the continuing convergence process has been going smoothly. What's the latest status on our primary Earth? It's been hard to keep up as the landscape shifts, but we've identified a number of new Earths that have merged with our own. Like this Earth, that was a refuge for immigrants from Xandar. And another, where Asgardians built a shared kingdom. Thankfully, We've managed to build friendly relationships with them, so far. Not all of them. We've absorbed entire regions that could end up as potential threats. It could be worse. Without Vision, none of this would even exist. Including us. 
The world isn't perfect. But we're making progress. Yeah. I'm pretty proud of what we've managed to accomplish in such a short time. We figured that out when you named it New Stark City. Things might be under control for the moment, but we're gonna have to keep fighting if we want to end this crisis for good. And there's only one group up for a task that big. Earth's last line of defense. Omega Flight. So, how many of you do we have on board so far? I've lost count. Our forces are strong, sir. But in a crisis this big, we could always use more soldiers.